everyone it's Laura Milligan and this is day five of five days in a row of Facebook lives I've been highlighting um, products some of my favorite products from our newly released mini catalog and also some celebration products and I have a super super cute card to share for you today before we get started if you're watching leave a comment I know sometimes there's a little bit of a delay but I just want to make sure that I've got everything set up and so say hello let me know where you're from and thank you so much for watching I do want to mention quickly that today is the last day to register for my peaceful cabin card class to go I have been talking about this all week it is a beautiful beautiful class and I've had a great response um, apparently if you go to the, the link to register it has closed because today was the last day to register but if you're still interested just shoot me a quick email um, or send me a message through Facebook and it's it's not too late to sign up you have until tonight so first thing tomorrow morning would be too late but if you let me know by tonight actually if you let me know by Sunday because I'm gonna be ordering all the products for this class on Monday morning so it's not too late if you're interested in this don't use the link you have to get in touch with me if you're interested so here is Colleen Tennessee Grand, Joyce from New Mexico, Myra from Kentucky. So I would like to introduce to you my very special guest today. I know some of you were trying to figure out who, sh who this person is and let me just give you a little hint. She has red hair. So here she is, our special guest for today. <laughs> Hi everyone. And tell them your name. My name is Lucy Rose, if you already knew me. Some of you already know Lucy, and I know that she's gonna get a lot of love from you today. We have, we used to do Facebook Lives together um, all the time, like weekly, but then COVID hit, and so we had to be really careful and we couldn't do that. So Lucy actually is here, she's spending the night tonight and we have some fun plans and so i decided to delay the facebook live today until i could get her to join me so we're excited we're gonna have fun aren't we yep i'm really excited to be here with you all seeing me which i hope you are <laughs> and i just got my hair done yes. shorter, if you guys noticed yes she got a spacious look sideways so they can see how cute it is look how cute she told me it's cute and spunky yep so cute okay mm -hmm. So Lucy, I'm gonna turn our camera down so they'll be able to see our hands and should we do some stamping? Yeah. All right. It so is, it's gonna be stamp-tastic. It's gonna be stamp-tastic, <laughs> is it ever? <laughs> How could it not be when Lucy's in the house? <laughs> Everything's stamp-tastic. Okay, here we go. Um, see Lucy, someone, Joyce says, hello Lucy, so glad to meet you. Everyone is saying how they missed you. Mm. So I missed you too. All right, so first I wanna show you, and Lucy, you haven't seen these yet, but I wanna show you all the projects that I made this week because I did Facebook Live every day. So I'm gonna put these out so everybody can see. Yes, Colleen says, I bet the card today will have a little bling on it. <laughs> Cause we all know Lucy loves bling. So I did this card, this is with the Autumn Harvest Suite. I used the penguins. This is cute, Lucy. It says, I love you a lot. -le. It's like a little except a lot. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Yeah. Here's a little tea bag with a little tea bag in it. Here's a beautiful pumpkin card. Um, for Halloween? Well, more for fall, actually. Oh. Yeah, it says gather together. And then here, yesterday, I made some cards with reindeer. And look how cute those are. So, Lucy, which one is your favorite? Which, if you had to pick your favorite, what would you pick? I actually love penguins. I knew it. Okay. So you like this one that says, I like you a lot. Yeah. This penguin is zooming down the hill. Isn't that fun? Just like me. Just like <laughs> Lucy. Okay. So what, what happens is, ladies watching, if you leave a comment any day this week, your name will be entered into a random draw to win these projects that I made, including the two that Lucy and I are going to make today. So, um, look, hi Lucy, look at Marsha, she sent, she's so happy that you're here. Every, I think everyone missed you. So well, to, I miss you guys too. Yes, we are so glad you're back. So today, um, 
The project we're going to use are actually um, products from our celebration catalog and they are adorable. They are, here's the penguins. Lucy likes penguins. Um, counting sheep stamp set and then they're coordinating sheep dies and let me show you these are the sheep dies so lucy when you when you look at this this is what they're seeing so they can't really see us right now and but they they're going to be able to see our hands so excuse me we'll switch back up at the end so they can see you again because i know they really want to see you okay so they don't see us on that camera but they do on here yes but what's live right now is this like what's in this box right here that's what they're seeing Okay, so they're gonna see our hands. So these are the sheep dies, and you can get the stamp set for a $50 purchase. That way you could get that for free, or you could get the sheep dies free with a $50 purchase. So what you really wanna do is get both of them, and we'll show you why, because this is a super cute project. All right, so let's set those aside, Lucy. Lucy doesn't really even know what we're gonna be making, but I have a, I have a kit for both of us, okay? So let's open up our kit and we have some parts and pieces in here ready to go. I'm going to scoot down a little bit so we can get you in the in the view as well. Here's Lucy's kit. All right. So we have a fence which is part of the sheep dies, okay? And then we have a little sheep that we already die cut and some other parts and pieces here. And so what we are going to do is our envelope. So we're gonna start with, let's see, I have my Stamparatus set up. Yeah, do you like that? You like that, don't you? Yeah. Okay, so we, what I've done, so actually my friend Sandra and Renee did some of the prep work for me for this. They helped me a lot, just like you do. And so what we're gonna do is I have die cut one of the sheep dies, actually they did it for me, and I'm just gonna put this in here. I've made a template, and so we're gonna ink up this sheep and stamp her, and this is a good way to do this. It's gonna save us some time. Um, and I'll show you another tip, Lucy. What I like to do when I'm using the stamp apparatus, it's a stamp positioner, it's kinda cool. So I'm gonna ink this up, Hi, Deborah. how are you? Okay, so we're gonna go ahead. I've got this sheep in my Stamparatus and I'm gonna go ahead and just ink her up. And there she is, look how cute she is. And then what I like to do is take my Take Your Pick tool and just use the putty end and pick her right up. Would you like to try, Lucy? Yeah. Okie doke, all right. So you might need to scoot down a little bit. Which way? Towards me. Here, let me get my legs out of the way. We're just yeah. going to squeeze you in here. Just say gently. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. And actually, I can move this whole thing down a little bit. So there's your sheep die. So, <coughs> excuse me. What you're going to do is take this and hold it upside down and just ink the sheep. Okay? But not, but not me. <laughs> not you. No, we don't. Well, sometimes I accidentally get ink on my fingers, but... Yeah, and just give it a good tap, tap, tap all over that, like this, like sort of, whoops, Ooh. like this, okay? Just tap, 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 tap across the sheep because you're going to get some ink on there. Perfect. Okay, that's pretty good. Let me just do oh. a couple extra taps yeah, just another, to be sure. We have another comment. Oh, my son was in town for the Hall of Fame game. Fun! Oh. We're going to the parade tomorrow, aren't we, Lucy? We are. Okay, so go ahead and close this up, and you'll get all the detail then on your little sheep. And just press down. You want to rub your hand across that. Yep, give it a little press. And let's see how we did. Perfect! Ta -da. Stamptastic! Okay, so do you want to try? This is putty, so it's it's gonna help pick that up. So just stick that straight down and pull it back up. Perfect. Okay. Ta -da. So we're gonna set this aside. You can go ahead and pull it off of the take your pick tool. I'm gonna to set my stamp apparatus aside. Okay, perfect. So cute. Okay, then we're gonna use this piece and we're gonna create a little scene. So I'll take mine and you have yours. Hi, Joan, how are you? Okay, Hi, Joan and Lucy. so 
let's start, first of all, um, let me grab some green ink here. Ooh. I need my garden, I was gonna use garden green. Okay, yep, so here's garden Thank green you. ink. All right, so here's our garden green ink and one of the stamps in this set is grass, okay? So we're going to just stamp a little bit of grass kind of across the bottom here, okay? We'll just ink it up each time and I'll let you do yours. I just did it kind of like that, all right? So you go ahead and do yours, Lucy. Just put a little bit of grass across there. And while you do that, I'm gonna go grab a little grid paper here. Mm. How'd, it, how'd you do? I think it's good. That yeah, looks good. Now what you might wanna do, what you might wanna try again, we can flip it over, ink it up again, and just give it a little bit lighter press, okay? I think sometimes, sometimes people think they have to press a little. Yeah, there you go, it's perfect. Oh. Perfect job. I went to the parade for many years. You have fun. Oh, we Thank sure you. will. Okay, so you wanna add a little more grass to yours? I'm gonna give you a mat. <laughs> and, and make sure when you go to the parade tomorrow, get some donuts. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Okay, so go ahead and add a cup, a little bit more. Oh. Just, just, just a light tap, tap, tap. And just straight down and straight up. Perfect, perfect, mm -hmm. perfect. Okay, now while Lucy's doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and add my fence. And it's just gonna go on either side. This is one of the dies and it's so cute because, let me hold this up, when it cuts, I don't know if you can see it, it actually cuts like, yeah, there you go, it cuts, just, it cuts detail on the fence, like it looks like wood, like a real wood fence would look. How you doing there, Lucy? I think I am looking good. Looking good, excuse <laughs> me, I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna reach in front of you and grab my glue. I call this green glue. Why do you think I call it green glue? Because the cap is green. Exactly. <laughs> it's actually called Tombow liquid glue, mono liquid glue, but Okay, so I'm gonna just take my glue and you just, you don't wanna put too much. A little bit will go a long way. So I see Lucy, how I'm just putting a little bit of glue on there. And I'm gonna position that right here, like that. Good, that looks good. Do you wanna find your fence? Speaking of fence, <laughs> it's a good thing that I have a fence up around my house. And why is that, Lucy? Why do you need a fence around your house? I have a dog, her name is Sasha, mm -hmm. and, and we have a fence for her so she won't get out. So she doesn't want to, so she won't run away, right? Right. Okay, so you're gonna, you're gonna go ahead and just add a little glue. Do you want me to help you or do you wanna do it by yourself? Hmm. Just a dot, right? Yeah, just a little dot, like just a couple little dots on there. There, there, maybe one in the middle there, like five dots. Let's move this down so people can see you, mm -hmm. see? They wanna see you. So just some little dab, perfect, yep. And I had to learn to do that because when I used to use this glue, I would squeeze the bottle too hard and get too much glue. Little one there, perfect. Yep, just a couple little dabs. I can't and really maybe right one more dab right there. That's perfect. I can't really tell if I got it. Yeah, you'd see you'd see the white. If you have, if you see white on there, that means you did. So go ahead. I'll take the glue. So go ahead and put your fence down. You can choose where you want it. I put it down here because we have to have room for our little die cut sheep. Oh yeah. Okay. Hmm. So go ahead and add your fence. Leave some room though. No, whoops. I'm sorry. Got to leave some room here for what we're going to stamp there too. So maybe go a little bit more the other way, just a titch that way. Like maybe, there you go, there you go. Okay, that looks good. And I, what I usually do is just hold it just like that. Yep, give it a minute. All right, now we're going to take this other sheep stamp, which is this one, okay? And we're going to stamp her. That at one the, is my favorite. <laughs> yeah, that's the one. That's the one we die cut. I love her. I like this one too because what I'm gonna do is stamp her um, like this, just right up by that fence. Like she's kind of kicking up her heels for 
for fun, just for fun. So you want to go ahead and add her on yours? I know I love heels. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like high heels? Yeah, but not too high. Me, I agree. I agree. Okay, so yep, go ahead and stamp your sheep. She can be kicking up her heels. Let's check and see. Yeah, that looks that looks good. Just straight up. Pick it straight up. Cute. Ta -da. Sounds it's almost like she's going bah. <laughs> 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 okay, now I think we need to make our sheep fancy. Be like with painted colorful hoofs. We don't mm -hmm. want any just plain playing sheep right we want to make them fun so this is this is called um, stamp and blend it's a special marker that you can add color to um, images like this so I'm gonna just color in her hoofs because she's a fancy sheep okay just like me just like you well you're not a sheep right but right the fancy part you're fancy you are definitely fancy so if you want to add color to her hooves and if you want to add color to her friends as well you can do that they're really fun it's fun to use those blends so uh, while Lucy's coloring I'm gonna go ahead and add um, do some stamping I'm gonna use the stamp you're amazing thank you yeah how did you know I was talking about you <laughs> You just said you're amazing. <laughs> Even our fans. Oh, look, Marsha's saying bah. <laughs> All right. Even our fans are amazing. They sure are. <laughs> do you think we have a lot of fans? I, I know you do. Oh, yeah. You Woo. do. Okay, so I just punched out with my oval punch the you're amazing. And Lucy, I have two choices of stamps that will fit on that um, oval. One says you're amazing and the other one says so glad it's your birthday. So which one would you rather stamp? You're amazing or so glad it's your birthday? You're amazing. I knew it. Okay. All right. So we'll go ahead. Isn't it fun to color like that? Okay. Oh, All right. Yeah. So let's let's set her aside a minute and let's stamp you're amazing Oops. because you are oh yeah so with the blends what you have to do you have to click them like that because they are alcohol based and they will Eek. dry up but not that kind of alcohol <laughs> it's a different kind of alcohol <laughs> okay so lucy let's stamp you're amazing so are you thank you sweet sweet lady <laughs> All right, so go ahead. You're gonna stamp your amazing on there. So tap, 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 and like, like you're gonna go tap, oh. tap, tap, tap. Like, oh, you know, we need to move over because they can't see you. Yeah. There you go. Okay, there you go. That's good. And go ahead and stamp that right on there. Ta -da. Perfect. All right, and so I'm gonna take this punch and line up the you're amazing. You are amazing, fans. Let's see, I think I need to, do you see my scissors, Lucy? I think they disappeared. Oh. Uh, you know what, oh, here they are. Oh, yep. There they are, okay. I'm gonna just trim this a little bit so that I can get it going the right but better be careful with those scissors. direction. I know, they're very sharp. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna go Being like sharp, that. You are sharp. Oh, Ooh. okay. So there's that, you're amazing. And then what we're gonna do is start putting this together. So I thought what would be really cute is to have this sheep, the fancy sheep, standing, dan it's like she's dancing right on top of the fence. Mm. Isn't that cute? That one's not though. You gotta pick, you gotta move her. Where do you want her to be? I'm putting mine oh. right on top of the fence, but you can choose where you want. I think that looks pretty cute. You may have a different idea. Hmm. And you can decide if you want to, like you could put her in the middle of the fence. Oh yeah. I'm gonna put mine right here, like that. She's just about to jump off the fence, it almost looks like. Maybe she thinks this is like a balance beam. Oh yeah, that's cute. Sure, 
Now, do you want to pop her up or just leave her flat like that? Pop her up. Pop her up, okay. So here's some dimensionals. So we'll go ahead and we'll add some dimensionals to the back of her. So you just pull those off. Remember, these are like little pillows. And it's gonna pop that up. You are sticky. Where do I put them? So you, I would put, I just put one like at the top and the bottom, and that should be enough. Whoops. It's, yeah, they are sticky, <laughs> yep. So then put one down there. <clears throat> oh. Oh. Yep, those are called dimensionals. Or showing the fans what they are. Okay. I think it's pretty cool that we have fans watching. And maybe celebrities are watching us. I think there probably are. Colleen's a celebrity. Marsh is a celebrity. I think a lot of the ladies watching are, are very special. Maybe Justin Bieber, Katy Perry, oh. Justin Timberlake. <laughs> I don't know. You think Justin Bieber's watching us today? That'd be pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> if it's on Facebook, he does have a Facebook account. Well, he's probably watching. He probably wants to see what you're making today, huh? <laughs> if you're not there, Justin Bieber, we're making cards. If, you if you're not me. there, Justin Bieber, you are missing out. Yeah. You too, Harry Styles. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go ahead and pop that up. Oh, yeah. Did I put the, this one on the bottom? Yeah, so put it on the bottom, and then you put her where you want her to be. And I stamped... There is a die for this hat in the sheep dies, but I stamped, just stamped it and cut it out. I don't mind doing a little, it's called fussy cutting. So, okay, you go ahead and put your, your sheep. So cute. All right. Now, I have this little hat, and that's gonna, I'm just gonna put the hat right behind her. The dancing sheep is actually me dancing. You love <laughs> dancing, don't you? I know you do. You love to dance. I'm just gonna tuck this right behind her head. Maybe it's her birthday and she's feeling special. Ooh, do you yeah. want to put, do you want to add a hat to yours? Yeah. All right, It'd let's put a little dab, it would be cute. Let's add a little dab uh, of, okay. Did you pick it up? Hmm. Gotta be careful. We're gonna end up with ink, inky fingers and sticky fingers maybe. So just hold it at the top and go ahead and put it where you want it to be. Perfect. That's so cute. And the nice thing about this glue is you can wiggle it a little bit. There's wiggle room. So if you want to pull it up a little bit, but I think that looks pretty good. Yeah. All right. So now we're going to add. I, I think she needs a birthday cake. Yeah, <laughs> that I would want a birthday cake if it was my birthday. So here are, here's the words. You're amazing. Now I have an oval, a scalloped oval that actually I punched ahead of time for us out of out of this double oval punch so there's a scallop oval and then a regular oval and you can decide Lucy if you want to add that or not the black thing yeah yeah the black thing you like that okay so look there's yours and then we have this twine and I know you said you like the twine so I'm going to tie a bow and I'm going to make it be kind of a big bow with kind of big loops not too big though. Can you tie a bow? Me? Do you know? Yeah, do you know how to tie bows? I think you probably do. Do you or do you want me to help you? Mm. I can do it for you if you want me to. I, I, so, I, I can try it first. Yeah, go ahead, there's your twine. I'm sure you can do a great job. All of it or some of it? What's that? All of it? Yeah, just tie a bow and then we can, if it's too long, we'll trim it. Okay. And then I'm going to take a dimensional and put it back there. <laughs> I made a tiny one. Ah, uh, do you want me to help you a little bit? Yeah. I'd be happy to. Okay, so let's see. I don't know how you make that pretzel into a. Oh, a bow. pretzel! You you tied a pretzel. Okay, so let's make a bow. There you go. And you can decide, Lucy, where do you want to put your bow? So I put mine under your amazing. But you actually, if you want to, you could put it on one of the sheep. Yeah. You like that? Okay, so if we're going to do that, let's make her 
let's make it a little bit smaller and we should probably snip it a little bit, right? Because right. we don't want to cover up her face. It's almost like a little bow tie. What do you think? Ooh. Yeah. Maybe it's still a little bit too big. We'll just give her a teeny tiny little bow because she's not very big. <laughs> like All right. Me. <laughs> yes, you're you're a small. You are a small woman. Okay. So go ahead and pull that off. The string? Yeah, pull the whole bow off. And there's a glue dot. I attach it to a glue dot. There you go. And you can position it wherever you want it to be. Whee. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead. Mine's going to be right here like this. And it looks like I need to adjust my bows a little bit too. They're kind of long. You decide where you want want it to be. Super cute. Oh, cute. Okay. And I'm going to snip mine a little bit because they're kind of long. I don't want to cover up the cute little sheep, their face. Eh. Do it like that. Eh. <laughs> Are you practicing your sheep, sheep talk? Yep. Okay. All right. So I'm going to add this. And I'll just go ahead and put that right there on my card front, like that. You're amazing. Okay, so why don't you go ahead? We can add. Do you want to just? You could just do it right like this, and then you can decide where you want it to be. It could be down there. You could maybe squeeze it up there a little bit, wherever you think. So first of all, we have to um, attach this to the black. So do you want to do that with a dimensional or with glue? Dimensional. I knew you would say that. Okay, so go ahead. You know how to do that part, right? Right. Okay, and then I'm going to go ahead and just put this together. And then Lucy will put yours together too. So I'm just going to mount this on a panel of basic black. Do you like stamping, Lucy? Yeah. It's fun, isn't it? It's fun to be creative and make cards. So who do you think... I'm going to send this card home with you. Who do you think... Um, you could send it to. Who do you know that's amazing? Well, she's on Facebook, and her name is Michelle, who is my supervisor. Oh, yeah, at work. Yeah. That would be work, great. Where I make candy. That would be great. How about, um, yeah, so go ahead, Lucy. We can take that off. Probably one is enough for this, so go ahead and just attach your amazing. I thought maybe you would say you wanted to send it to your brother. Oh, that would be good too. He's pretty amazing, right? Right. Yep. All right. So now I'm going to just attach this panel to my card front. So Lucy, where do you want to put the, your amazing on your card? Can you find a spot to fit it? This is fun. I'm, I'm glad you're here. I didn't want to cover that hat. No. How about... How about if we just put it kind of right there like that? Ooh, yeah. And it almost looks like she's saying, you're amazing. Like, I don't know how a sheep would say that, but. Yes. <laughs> okay. And then, actually, we can check. because You're amazing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So let's add a little bit of glue. We have another comment. Myra is amazing. Lucy's. Okay. So Sandra says, Lucy, you make a perfect sheep sound. Well, thank you. It would be fun. Is that good? Yeah. Okay. So now we're going to take some glue. It would be fun if we could hear our viewers today because I bet some of them are back behind as they're watching us. What do you think? Yeah. Okay. So let's put this on here like that. That's looking pretty good. Okay. And then for the card base, we're using a color called Poppy Parade. Uh is a poppy parade and we're going to a parade tomorrow. we are going to a parade tomorrow so we're gonna let's fold this in half now what I like to do Lucy is line up these edges and then we have a tool and if you you can take this and just go like that and it makes a nice crisp fold on your card what do you mm. think I, I thought it was a nail file it does kind of look like a nail file it's called a bone folder so it makes a nice crisp fold so then we're going to add our sheep, right? So why don't you put some glue? Do you want to add the glue or do you want me to do it for you? I think you should do it. And you just need to squiggle it around the edges. And again, you don't really need a lot. Little dab will do ya. Ooh, 
Oh boy, I, I don't think we need that much. Let's spread some of this out a little bit because we don't want it to blob um, all over. Well, I thought you said all over. I did. Ooh. Actually, I think this looks pretty good. I just don't want it to come blobbing out. Mm. It's fun to it's fun to squirt a lot of glue on there, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's just flip it over. Go ahead, you can put it on your card front. You actually did good. It's gonna stick really well. Okay, and let's make sure, yep, that looks really good. Okay, now. What do you guys think? Do yeah, what like do you think? Card? Do you like? Oh, Myra says, are we watching the parade or are we in the parade? Hmm. What do you, do you know? Are we in the parade tomorrow or are we just watching? Well, first, I wish. <laughs> um, I think we're watching, right? We're just watching. Yeah, mm -hmm. we're watching the parade. But I do remember, um, yeah, I think there's been other times when Lucy's been in a parade, right? Okay, so oh, Lucy, yeah. go ahead and squiggle just a little bit of glue on the back of this. This will be for the inside of our card. Yeah, and just, yeah, so let's just go like this. Let's squeeze it. <laughs> That's good. That's plenty. This is going to stick really well. Okay, yeah. so go ahead and flip this over, Lucy, and we'll attach it to the inside of your card. Okay. All right, and I think it would be fun if I can find, here's this Wee. sheep. Oops, it moved. That's okay. You know what? Let's just, it's the nice thing about this glue is it gives us some wiggle room. So let's see if it also sticks kind of fast though. Woo! <laughs> let's see if we can wiggle it around. There we go. See, we can fix it. It wiggled a little bit too much. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, it was, maybe the paper was dancing with the sheep. It was dancing, that's right. Now, if you want to, I always think it's fun. We could we could put one of these sheep on the inside. Oh, and then they're coming. So cute, ladies. So I'm gonna put her right here. This is the one that's kicking up her heels. She's oh. so cute. Do you want to add her to the inside of your card? Oh yeah. Okay. So tap, 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 tap. Perfect. There you go. And go ahead and stamp her. The door. Oh, look, she's moved. That is, that's really cool. Cause it looks like she's actually dancing. I love that you did that, Lucy. I wish, I wish we had clouds. So she didn't dance. There's a cloud. Uh, well, and actually, I think there are, you know what, in these dies, I didn't cut any out for us today, but there are actually some cloud dies, so that would be something that we could do. Mm -hmm. But this is how I made my card, but I, I did not add any bling. But uh -oh. since I knew, uh-oh is right, since I knew my friend Lucy was coming, I pulled out some bling that I thought you would want to use. So you could use rhinestones, or these are called black matte dots. Which ones would you prefer? I have a Sparkly. guess. I knew it. Do you want to use these or the black? You could actually use some of each if you mm, want. Yeah. You want to use some of each? Okay. So let me show you this tool. This is the one we used to get our die out of the Stamparatus. So if you, if you hold this in your hand and just push... Mm. And then you just put this wherever you want it. You go ahead and try it. Just set that down where you'd like it to be. Super cute. And you want to get some more? Oh, yeah. So just push. Let's see if you can do this. I think you'll be able to. So kind of, it's sort of like this. And you push, whoops, push it away. There you got one. And figure out where okay. you'd like that one to be. Hmm. That'd be cute. Okay, some of our putty's coming off. Okay, Ooh. and you wanna add maybe one more? Oh, yeah. Okay, go ahead and add one more. You could, there's small ones or big. There's actually three different sizes, small, medium, and large. You want a small one, so push away, push it away. You kind of have to angle it like this and push. There you go. Okay. That one's so little you can barely see it, but it's on there. Yeah. So figure out where you want that to be. Oh, fancy. Okay, you think that's good? Is that enough? Oh, I didn't add the black yet. You want to put some black on there? Yeah. Okay. All right. So go ahead. And then I'm going to switch the camera up so everybody can see you again. Okay, push away. So it's more like this, Lucy. Like this, at an angle. Push, whoops. Push, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> hmm. 
How about maybe one right there? And maybe one more, maybe a small one right beside that. That would be, I think that would kind of even it out. So push away, see how you do. Perfect, yeah, see? Yay. So put that over there. Everyone says they like these. They think they're really cute. Okay. Thank you. So here's mine. Mine's a little plain compared to fancy Ooh. Lucy's, right? But I'm going to go ahead now. Ooh. Here we go, Lucy. So let's hold, hold your card up and tell them who are you going to send it to. I'm going to send this one to my brother. Oh, so nice. And, and he is living in Chicago right now, isn't he? Yeah, right now he's living in Chicago. So Greg... Um, if you're here on Facebook, uh, make sure to uh, watch this video of me making this card for you. Oh, that's so sweet, Lucy. Mm -hmm. We'll we'll put this in the mail to him. Maybe he'll get it next week one day, okay? We'll have to get his address from yeah. your mom. All right, well. I love you, bro. Aw, okay. So anything else you want to say to, the, to our viewers before we say goodbye? I just <clears throat> wanted to uh, thank my fans. Uh, and uh, thank you very much for sending in, sending in our comments. Yes, show us some hearts, right? We love our hearts. and the, We love our hearts and our, and our bling. And, and we love the thumbs up and any comments. Yeah. And if you comment, you will be in the drawing to win one of our cards. So Lucy and I are going to say goodbye now, and we're going to go have some fun. But not that this wasn't fun. Do you want to come back and stamp with me again someday? I would. It, well, well, actually, uh, since I don't have my job since COVID, I was hoping maybe I could uh, work as being a card maker like you. I think you'd be a natural. You already are. I mean, you're a natural. I think that'd be awesome. So we'll have you come back and stamp with me again sometime, okay? What do you all think? I'm sure that our fans that are watching would agree, right? Mm -hmm. Look, everyone's saying, bye, Lucy. Thank you. You look so pretty today, Lucy. Oh, thank you. All right. So we'll say goodbye. Bye. And we hope that you all have a great weekend. And let us know. I think you all kind of feel, I think the general consensus is they would like Lucy to come back and stamp with us again. Um, that's always a treat. And so mm -hmm. we'll say goodbye. Bye. Happy August. And as always, I hope you have time to be creative today. Take care everyone, have a great Take weekend. Bye-bye.